All right, YouTube. We are putting out the bait hives. Back over there, you see that silo. Over there, that's where all the bees are. This is a Catawba tree that they like to swarm on some, but that thing is wrapped with poison ivy or poison oak. So what we found, what we found was this uh, magnolia tree here. And so it's got some nice limbs. We're gonna put a full size bait hive right up in there somewhere. Mason's up there. We're gonna set it and strap it and see what we can come up with. So uh, anyways, here we go. Bennett, get that full size hive out of there. <clears throat> All right, there's the opening. Mason, we want the opening facing the road. can't do is turn that hive all sideways like that. The frames are going to get knocked around. You've got the opening in your wrong hand. You need to turn it around. You can't you can't load it like that, Mason. Turn it around. Right on top of these two limbs. You can't go too far. All right, YouTube, there's the first bait hive hung in a tree. I had to turn the video off because Mason was about to fall. We were fighting a grizzly bear on top of a tree. It wasn't good. There it is. Hopefully she works. Pardon the, the filming. So what we did is we put a couple of support screws uh, right there. We got another one right there just to set that edge on and we're using the trees and a strap we got a couple bricks on the top so lord willing we'll get bees in that one now we're going to try hang something on that big old catawba tree hung in this tree we're hanging them on the east side of the tree as soon as we get the drill tight Learn how to hang them here on the east side of the tree so that it blocks them from afternoon sun. Ouch, that hurt. So, I'm using two screws to strengthen it. This is going to give us southern entrance. Now I need a strap. All right, there's that hive trap. As you can see, I'll try to shield it because I'm fixing to look straight in the sun. There's the barn. The owner of the place said that the bees, when they swarm out, they'll hit this little line of trees right through here. So maybe this is the magic spot. We'll see. All right, this is swarm trap number four. It's some kind of thorn bush. This thing's terrible. We got stuck and cut a couple times. So anyways, we'll see what happens. So there's the trap. There's the barn. We're gonna go hang All right, there's the last trap, number six. There's an absolutely huge willow tree right there. We wanted to hang it in that willow tree, but that looks snaky, so we weren't going in there. So we hung it right here. Hopefully they'll find it. We hope. Because the barn now is on the other side over there. And uh, we're not going to go back by those bees. It's warm enough today. They are out and going. Because uh, I had one hit me in the ear and stung me, and one hit me in the eye and stung me, and I don't want any more of that. So we're going to leave them over there. So anyways, this is the crew, running dog apiary. Y'all come go with us.